Hey lovelies, it's me, Tiffany. I'm here with you today, uh, not to talk about housewives, but don't worry because that one is coming. I'm gonna watch the Atlanta Housewives reunion tonight and take my notes so I can do my video tomorrow for everybody. So today I'm just gonna like unbox with you some products um, that just came in the mail recently for me. Um, and then I'm going to actually go through some other ones that I just want to let you know my thoughts on. Because why not? Okay. So first, I want to talk to you all about Greek's glasses. They asked me to be a brand ambassador. And so I said yes. Because I looked um, over their brand and I really liked what I was seeing. And I am so ple I'm pleasantly surprised because the glasses came in this like nice case, pus wrapped in this nice other little case to keep it safe. And they even send you a cleaning uh, cloth for your glasses and I probably need to do mine so I'm just gonna do it right now anyhow so these are the ones that I chose then these are cat eyeglasses and I love them look at them you've probably seen uh some of my pictures of them mm -hmm. I like them so Mm -hmm. they are good quality nice weight to them they're cute of course i've gotten so many compliments on them so go to greek go to greek glasses okay go take a look and then you can use my code which i will also put down here which is Tiffany Dicty. So I'll put that, like I said, down below and then go take a look, save some money and get a good pair of sunglasses. Summertime's coming, which actually I wear sunglasses all year round because my eyes always need to be protected. Protect your eyes, get sunglasses. Okay, so there is that. Now, my next thing is that I'm going to actually just start to open up some of my new stuff because I'm pretty excited here. So, this is, um, and like my, this is going to probably be like all over the place with stuff. There's no rhyme or reason. It's just stuff that I recently bought. So, my first unboxing box is from Revive. Revive is an essential oils company that I've been buying their oils for like a year now. Um, I've always been interested in doing essential oils. Like I've always really enjoyed my friends that have them diffusing in their home. But um, I hate to say it, but the MLM uh, companies are just a little too expensive for me. I don't like trying to have somebody sell things to me. Um, but I found Revive. I think that there was a Facebook ad that came up and I happened to find Revive. And um, what it is, is that their oils are just as great as these other MLM companies, which I won't, I'm not going to name the other ones because if you know anything about essential oils, you already probably know what companies I'm referring to. Um, but Revive, all I got was sleep because that's the only one I need um, right now. Let's see if it'll focus. Hmm. Well, anyways, so this one I've diffused like nightly, uh, obviously, because it's called sleep and it just smells so good. Um, there's a little bit of rose oil in there, which I love. Mm, I love it. Uh, so yeah, check out Revive. They're, this box is kind of like worn off right here, but um so they make them in the usa uh bottled 
There is no middleman, so there's no MLM. Their pricing, I think, is really good. I mean, this sleep blend, I think that it was maybe $13, which, I mean, if you know your oils, I feel like that's pretty good um, pricing. So, and you can order from them all the time. You can even subscribe. They have monthly boxes. Uh, no, they're not paying me. I mean, but if you ever want to revive, I would be more than happy to partner up with you because I love your uh, oils. Actually, while I have everybody here, I'm just going to go put this one with my whole collection and I'll show you guys my little collection here in my bathroom. Um, here you are. So, yeah. I have lots of them. Lots of oils. I like my essential oils. Um, I diffuse them. I don't really use them topically and I don't use them on my uh, body, but I still like to diffuse them. I have a few diffusers in the house, so that's mainly what I do oils for. I'm not a big oil person, so please don't ask me too many <laughs> questions about what each one's used for because I just like to diffuse them for the smells, if I'm being honest. Okay. Oh, so I know I unboxed this already with you guys before. Um, but today I'm wearing the Lizzie McGuire palette. Oh, I finally used it. I'm so excited. So I always keep these. If you're ever wondering why these are always falling out in my videos, it's because I keep some. So, um, let's see. I did, ugh, outfit repeater, outfit rem rememberer. And bye bye were the ones I used today. Oh, I had so much fun. So, anyways, that's what I used finally today. Um, I love ColourPop. It it really is like again. I'm not getting paid by ColourPop for talking about them right now. I'm just talking about how much I love. Like this is my favorite makeup brand. Again, ColourPop. If you want to. <laughs> do anything with me, I wouldn't love it. But otherwise, I just think it's a really great makeup brand. It's super, super affordable. Like yesterday, they might even still have, this um, is a 12 color palette. And right now, at least over the weekend, I don't know if it's still going, so don't get mad if you go right now and look. Anyways, over this past weekend, they had these for $12. So, just saying. They're normally like, I think this one's normally 22, I want to say, somewhere around there. Anyhow, I love ColourPop. They have really great product. Um, their makeup's good quality, but it's so uh, affordable. And I don't know if you watched my other unboxing where I opened up um, an eyeshadow palette that was broken. I got in touch with the company and they are so wonderful. They're sending me out a replacement. It's already shipped. Um, I'm just waiting it for, for it to arrive. So when it does, I'll be unboxing it. So you can see what it looks like, not broken. Anyhow, so my next thing is gonna be um, Hip Dot, which I just actually started kind of learning about this company. Maybe I'm just so into ColourPop that I, I'm not branching out enough. Anyway, so I follow an Instagrammer named, uh, his name is Faced by Cream. And he already knows how much I love his looks because I comment on him all the time. So, hey, Cream, I got your makeup brushes, like I told you. Silly me, never even knew you had them. Let's not pay close enough attention. I don't know. So I got his makeup brush set because I love him. I need to get his eyeshadow palette too. So I got that from Hip Dot. Let's see, there's a flat brush. Eyeshadow brush. 
I always love the netting on these. I don't know why, but it's so much fun. Does anybody else have fun with like the netting on your brushes? And a face brush. And that even has him, his name. Are you gonna focus camera? Focus. Face by Kareem. So I'm excited to use your brush set, honey. Yes, yes, yes. Seriously, go check him out though, because he, if you don't already know about him, you, you need to learn. He's, he's a really, I think he's a really talented uh, makeup artist. Okay, so while I was getting his brushes, I saw that they did a SpongeBob palette. Again, I grew up in the 90s, okay? Spongebob came out when I was, like, an older kid. So, this is nostalgia. This is, like, everything. I can't help it. Heck, ColourPop's coming out with a uh, Malibu Barbie collection in a few days. I'll be, I'll be probably getting that. Okay. Mm, look at that. I like that packaging. Mm. So fun. And here we go. Let's open her up. You guys hear that? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, look at those colors. Mm, those are going to be so fun to play with. Oh, yes. So this is called the, the Bikini Bottom Palette. And, oh my gosh, I love some of these names. Tree Dome, Bikini Bottom Blue, Best Shade Ever. Ah, kind of like Best Day Ever. Wumbo, Penny Pincher, and it's in a red color. Perfect for Mr. Krabs. Coral Floral. Angry Tentacles. <laughs> Imagine, imagination. There's two A's in there. Because, you know, you got a imagination. Meow, meow, meow. That's scary. Jumping Jellyfish. <laughs> Rock Bottom. Deep Blue Sea. Golden Pineapple. Blue Lagoon. And Advanced Darkness. Hmm. All right, Hip Dot. We can't wait to play with this. I've never purchased from Hip Dot before. I've gotten their products from beauty subscriptions um, that I have. Oh, also, over the weekend, because it's Mother's Day. It was also, I, if you watch my video um, going over the New York premiere, I talked about my best friend's uh, daughter was turning 13 and I went to a birthday party. Well... She wasn't the only one getting gifts. My best friend also got me presents for like my birthday that was a couple weeks ago and then for Mother's Day, which was obviously yesterday. And in it, look what she got me. I'm wearing it. So I have Kylie lips. Um, so I love uh Benito Skinner or Benny Drama, however you know him, I love his videos. And he's oh, he does the best Kardashian impersonations. Like, I haven't watched Keeping Up With the Kardashians since, like, 2014. But I watch his skits and his parody videos, and um, I live for them. They are so funny. Please go follow him. Benny, if you ever happen to watch this, um, which if you do... Let me just faint now because I'd be like over the moon. But um, the the he does a skit where he has Kim going to Kylie's pop up, um, and I just always think of that whenever I see this because he like moves hers and puts in Kim. You'd have to watch it. Go watch it. It's hilarious. You'll laugh. Anyways, thank you, best friend, for getting me a a Kylie lip kit because um. I probably would have never actually came around to getting one. Uh, but yeah, I do like it. I had to put, um, it's very matte, 
which I think is great, but for my look today, because like obviously I have this nice hot pink feel, um, I put a little bit of uh, the So Juicy ColourPop lip stuff on me, because you know, just had to lighten that up a little bit. Okay, oh, speaking of SpongeBob, Wet n Wild has their new SpongeBob collaboration out, which is very hard to get. Um, let me tell you, they are going like hotcakes. I, I can't even believe the little pieces of the collection I've gotten. And this is my latest little piece that I've gotten to snag, which is the Krabby Patty makeup brush sponge um, kit. So you can clean your brushes and sponges. Clean them. It's so important. Don't neglect your brush care. Don't do it. You'll regret it. Get something fun that'll make you want to do it. I know. It's like an hour process, if not longer. I don't time it. It'd be too depressing. I don't I don't time how long I take to do my brushes. All I know is that I do it at least once a week. I wish I did it like twice, but we're gonna just take what we can get. I do it at least once. So anyways, that's my little Krabby Patty guy sponge sponge and brush cleaning pad kit. It's super cute. Mm. Um, okay. So I've posted about lounge fly before. Again, lounge fly is not paying me for this. I paid them for their product because I love them. And now I'm just going to talk about it because I love them. So I got this like a month ago, my very first ever lounge fly bag. My little guys. Soup's cute. Like, look at that. Looks like the little measuring tape, but it's like ribbon. Ugh. And I couldn't just get the bag without also getting the wallet to match. Look at that. Oh, it's so cute. Okay. So, oh, I always like the inside. That's what the in the inside liner looks like too. It's the um. I don't want to get the wrong year. 70th, 70th edition, 70th year celebration edition. Ugh, there you go. I got it all out. Okay. So I really, I love this bag so much, but I want to keep it in like good shape. And I felt like I was kind of beating it up. So luckily Loungefly sells these cute little cross bodies. I got this at Hot Topic. You guys, when I was growing up, Hot Topic was not this. Like, no, this was like, you would never find this at Hot Topic when I was growing up. It was not the Hot Topic that it is today. Anyways, this is super cute and it's also lounge fly. And these are actually super um, affordable. It was literally, they're like under $15. So if you don't want to splurge on this, which I understand, I'm probably not going to have many of these. I have this one and then I'm unboxing my newest one. Okay, but I probably won't get many more of these little bags because I love them, but sometimes I just can't justify the price. Hey, I like to spend money, but I'm not trying to spend myself broke on one item, you know? Ugh. All right, so this is my newest lounge fly. Um, so when I was growing up, Pocahontas was one of my favorite movies that came out. I had the bedding. I watched the movie every day. I had cups. I had, I mean, we, we were very into Pocahontas in my house growing up. So, Loungefly is now partnering up with, like, Pop Funko Pops. And, um, look, I haven't even taken it out of the plastic, and I've had this. Okay, fine. I just got delivered yesterday. But still, like, I haven't even opened it yet. Someone opened it with you. Thank you, special. Who's ever watching? If there's anybody you've been watching. Heck, I'm probably just opening this up for myself to look at. And I'm just thinking people are watching. Either way. <laughs> so, look at this. Look at the little arms. So, this is Nico. He's the raccoon. And this is Flit. Flit, the hummingbird. Some people call him Flick. 
It's not flick, it's flit. Not that I work at Disney and I need to get like all technical about it. Anyway, so I couldn't resist and I literally told my husband like, I'm getting this bag because I was obsessed. And then my favorite song, Can You Paint With All The Colors Of The Wind, Colors Of The Wind, whatever. Are you kidding me? It has the leaves and it says, can you paint with all the colors of the wind? It was like meant for me. <laughs> Thank you, Loungefly and um, Funko. I know you don't know me, but I feel like you do after making this because this is definitely me. <sighs> oh my gosh, I cannot wait. So again, these are a little bit more pricey. You're going to spend some money on these, okay? They're, I'm not even going to say, it's obnoxious to even say what price they are. You can go look at their website yourself and you can see, and then you can go ahead and think I'm nuts because I would spend that sort of money on a bag. Although, there's women out here that are spending like... This is probably like nothing to them. They're probably, you're one of those that spends way more and you're laughing at me than, that's, <laughs> but this is, this is a lot for me. Someone that spent on a bag because I'm just not that kind of person. <laughs> so yes, go check out the Pocahontas um, collection though. I think it's so cute. Heck, all their bags are cute. What am I saying? <sighs> and so, being a Disney nerd that I am, I don't care how old I am. I don't care if that I'm in my 30s and that I am still sporting Disney bags and my love of Disney. Like, when you catch me out here when I'm 70 doing the same, mind your business then just like you need to mind your business now because I love Disney. I don't know why I'm trying to defend myself. There's a lot of people my age that love it. There's, that's... That is why they make these products. It's for people that are like me that will spend the money on it. Ooh, this tape is on there, guys. Okay. So since I didn't, I didn't want to get the wallet to go with that. Um, because they also have the um, Fox and the Hound, which was one of my favorites as well. Because I always just loved Todd. And I was so sad. Todd's the fox. And I was so sad that the lady, like took him back to live in the forest and just left him because Copper's owner thought he was a pesky fox. They just wanted to be friends and play. That grumpy old dude. Ugh. And his grumpy old dog too. Chief. Anyways. <gasps> the inside has Copper howling. Oh my gosh. He says, I'm Todd, I'm a fox. And he goes, I'm Copper and I'm a hound dog. If you've seen the movie, you know what I'm talking about. And your heart is melting thinking of it just like mine is. Love it. So that's my wallet that I got to have at least one of the pieces from that collection since I was already getting the Pocahontas. Why not? Okay, so that brings me to, oh, my last couple things I want to talk about is another company that I've also decided to um, partner with to be a brand ambassador, although they have uh, bags, so different than the um, sunglasses. Gosh, sometimes my brain just gives out on me. So I posted pictures of these bags, but I want to show them on camera too. So first, this is the necklace that comes with your purchase. It's cute. It's a rose. I like it. Obviously, this is like the third time I've worn it. Um, so here is the handbag with, uh, this one's Leia. And it ha they come in other colors too, but I just loved the um, gray and I needed a gray bag. So, and of course the like stars for me are just fun. But it's just a nice like little bag. Like if you're going out, um, you know, 
Just need a few things, which that's me most of the time. I just need a few things. That's another reason why I don't need too many of those mini book bags because I really don't know what to put in them. And then this is their, oh, this Mil Milani. I believe this is Milani. This one's cute too. It's just purple. It's purple. Do I not know my colors? This is pale pink. Purple. Pink. And uh, again, it's just a nice little one, uh, bag that you can wear if you're just going out for the night. Just something cute. And I like the gold chain. Like I just, I don't know. There's just something about a nice little chain on a bag that makes you just feel nice and fancy. So this is Rosero. And um, so R-S-E-R-O. And you can save money by putting in my coupon code, Tiffany Dickty, which again, I will put down here for you. So you can save some money and look at their little handbags. They're super cute. It was hard to decide which ones and I couldn't get like all of them. So I had to narrow it down. Uh, let's see. I think that's everything today that I'm unboxing or showing you, you know. I'm going to do my housewives videos. I have, like I said, I have four of them this week. I have four that I can do. Um, I'm going to watch the Real Housewives of Atlanta, the last part of the reunion tonight. Then I'm going to have the second part of the Dallas reunion. The second episode in on um, New York Housewives and Beverly Hills premiere. This is going to be a good season. I just, I feel. I feel Beverly Hills is really going to be giving it to us this season. Well, if you have watched my videos for this long, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Go ahead and subscribe. Um, I'm trying to think of a name for like my housewives channel. Do I want to call it a channel? Sure. We'll call it a channel. I'm trying to think of a name. I'm thinking, I thought about turtle time with Tiffany. Because, you know, Ramona and Turtle Time. But for one, I haven't looked to see if anybody else has already done it. For two, I'm not drinking while I'm talking about it. So to me, it kind of like is misleading to say Turtle Time. Because then what if people think I'm like just getting drunk and <laughs> watching Housewives talking about it. I don't want to mislead anybody. But um, yeah, I'm trying to think of something. I'm working on it. Um, but anyways, that was the video for the day. I hope you enjoyed it and I just hope to see you again next time. Bye. Yeah, we're going to start saying bye like that. If you've ever seen this movie, Goosebumps, yes, I have kids. The second one, the Halloween one, the next door neighbor, he always says bye. And so I say that with my kids a lot. So you know what? I think from now on, that's how I'm going to be signing off. I'm going to say Bye. Have a good day, guys.